Hi everybody! Oh my goodness guys, this is a... I don't know, kind of bittersweet moment, um, I, I don't know how to say it, but yeah, um, like you know, I've been telling you in the past few months, uh, very soon I'm gonna be moving, um, I'm gonna be moving from the northeast to Florida, so that's a long long way and you know, I have seven babies total and it would be pretty hard for me to take all seven babies with me, you know, I don't, you know, it's kind of like too much of a hassle. Um, so, like I explained, there were uh, a few of my babies that I was going to have to sell. Uh, so, you know, so I would have to carry all seven babies with me. And Miss Brianna is one of them. I have other three babies that I'm going to be selling. So, I'm going to have three babies left in my collection. Uh, and the second reason why I decided to do that, even though for the longest time I I was having an extremely hard time to, you know, let my babies go. Because uh, I don't know, I just get attached. It's like, even if I don't have a very strong bond, I, I don't know. There was a time when I would even imagine selling my babies and I would feel like guilty or something like that. Like, it wasn't right. But you know, then you think about it, I mean, it's a doll, it's not a real baby, okay? So, um, and the second reason why I decided to do that also is because selling these four babies that I want to sell, I'd be able to get um, a higher quality reborn, you know, a reborn from one of my favorite artists and, you know, when the artist is great, um, you know, their work is not cheap. <laughs> So, um, yeah, so I think by selling four of my babies, which are, I'm not going to say they're bad quality, not at all, but, you know, they're not high quality, you know what I mean? Um, by selling four of those, four of my babies, I'll be able to get the money to hopefully order, you know, a higher quality reborn uh, from one of my favorite artists. So, um, yeah, okay, I'm going to stop rumbling and let me show you. Uh, this is Brianna. And she's a Leah kid uh, by Sandra White, I believe. I gotta, I gotta double check that. Uh, and look at this sweetheart. I mean, she was, I think, the, either the first or second uh, reborn that her artist made. Um, her name is Avery. I think I'm not sure if she still uploads videos here on YouTube, but she has a YouTube channel. And I don't think she she's reborn in anymore. Uh, she's not reborn at the moment. She, she, you know, she made a few babies and then she stopped. But um, Yep, this is, um, I think, her first or second, like I said, and I love this sweet face. I mean, I love the sweet face. Uh, the detail, if you can see over there, you know, she doesn't have hair or anything, but I don't know. I like her the way she is. She's very, very cute. And yep, so you can see the detail there. She has pretty good detail, detailing. Well, I don't know how to, and I don't know how, to, how you say that when they have the skin like that like remember guys English is my second language so <laughs> and then what I never like about this kid were um, the hands that's my like um, I don't know something I didn't like and if you can see she's not perfect she has you know some boo-boos uh, like I said the, the artist was just you know studying reborning so it's, it's normal and common to um, to make mistakes so um yeah so as you can see she has like some kind of like stains on her uh, hands like darker spots um i don't know this one this one is better but yeah um and my camera doesn't want to focus i don't have uh, the camera that i was using before guys anymore because uh, that wasn't my camera actually it was my dad's and i met up with with him on the vacations and he took it so yeah so i'm using my dslr now uh, and now let me show you, I'm, I'll be right back and I'm gonna show her without any clothes so um, whoever wanna buy her knows what the body looks like, okay? Because I think that's uh, important. So I'll be right back, guys. Okay, and I'm back. Um, she has only diapers on right now. And let me show you, she has full arms and full legs, which is uh, really nice. Um, like I said, about this kid, I like... The limbs are fine, what I don't like is like the hands. That's what I don't like and that's why I used to put um, 
scratch meetings on her all the time. Now, let me show you uh, another couple of flaws that she has. Um, I accidentally dropped her once. And after that, her head is like, look what I'm talking about. Now, I'm a chicken and I've never like um, opened one of my babies or changed their bodies or anything like that. So um, if you are a little bit braver than me, which uh, probably you are, <laughs> uh, and don't mind you know, maybe adjusting the head um, a little bit more, see, so it doesn't, because it, 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 it feels like it's going to fall. That's what it feels like. Uh, and you know, guys, I'm a very honest person. Like, I don't want to... Um, tell anybody oh yeah she's perfect you know and then uh, when you get her you you start finding the, the flaws and stuff I'm not like that so I'm gonna I want you to know what her uh, flaws are okay uh, so yeah so you can see see that she has like some like darker spots or something you know same thing with her legs um, her feet I love her feet her feet are adorable. Look at that. Very, very cute. Her feet are maybe some of my favorite favorite parts <laughs> on this baby. Um, yeah, and then let's see another flaw that she has. Well, here, see, it's like, I don't know. Her legs are kind of like loose. See that? See the joint there? It's too loose. I think she would need some, um, maybe some more stuff in there or something. Yeah. That's that's what I would do. Now let me turn her t turn her around, turn her uh, over. I'll be right back. And then okay, she's um, her back is facing me, and I don't know. Probably if um, she might need a new body, I would say. Um, she she has like I don't know. This is stuff and it's kind of weird. It looks like. See what her back back looks like. I don't know if you can see, guys. But yeah, she looks. I don't know, kind of weird. Her back is too curved, I would say. I don't know. But other than that, um, you know, um, like I said, I'm in love with um, the detail on her head. I think it's very realistic. She looks very realistic on the pictures too. That's something that I like about her. Gosh, I gotta be so careful. <laughs> but yeah, so, um, you know, so, other than that, I mean, I took good care of her, except that time when I dropped her, poor thing. But, um, yeah, she's, uh, like I said, she has her flaws, she's not a perfect baby, uh, but she is adorable. And I think it would be, um, you know, the price is, is not high, I'm not going to sell it for, for a lot. Uh, so I think it would be great for someone that is starting on the hobby, you know, and... That's how you usually start, you know, you, you don't spend, it's kind of, I don't know. Not many people start this hobby with, with a $500 or more uh, doll, you know. So uh, so sh her price, I think it's uh, affordable when it comes to reborns, for reborn standards, okay. Uh, give me just one second, guys. So, um, yeah. So her price is going to be $80 plus shipping. Shipping, oh, and I'm only going to ship, and this is very important, I'm going to put it on the description box, but I'm only going to ship inside the U.S., and that goes for all the other three babies that, that I have for sale. Uh, just because, you know, it's easier. Um, I don't know, sometimes I hear, like, customs, you know, uh, get the stuff, and then they, they kind of have it there for a long time, and till it clears and, and all that and I don't know and also shipping would be very very expensive I mean I know like if I wanted to get a, a doll from Europe it would be like $70 for shipping which I think is crazy um, I mean it's not that I would never get a doll from Europe because of that I mean but you know if I gotta choose I kind of prefer the US shipping because it's cheaper <laughs> um, yeah so shipping is gonna be I don't know, it used to be like, I don't know, 20, 25, I think. Um, you know, we we'll probably send it on those um, flat rate uh, boxes, shipping boxes. Um, you know, that you get, you get them in like two days, so it's very like expedited shipping. Um, so you, you won't have to worry about that. But yeah, so let's say it's going to be between shipping and the doll itself, like 100, 105. 
you know around around then um, probably if I can check your zip code um, if you tell me your zip code um, I can check that or you can check that on the USPS um, website so yeah so I'm only gonna ship inside the US and another thing and very important um, is due to I don't know some kind of bad stories that I hear and stuff I'm only gonna sell this doll to someone that is 18 years or older uh, I know there's a lot of uh, girls that are under 18 in the community I know that and I'm sure there are amazing amazing um, you know 12 13 14 year old girls out there uh, but I don't know at least for now I just I want to say my I want to save myself from from the hustle um, to have to deal you know not, not everybody is uh, responsible and nice and, and and all that so uh, especially you know when you're younger <laughs> so yeah so I've decided that I'm only gonna sell it to um, someone that is 18 years or older and that lives in the US so I don't have to worry much about the shipping and you know it's just make things easier so I hope you understand my decision I don't want to offend anybody I don't want anybody to get mad at me or anything like that um, I'm just trying to make this uh, easy and I want to sell them quickly because I should be moving sometime in June I would say so I want to sell them quickly okay um, now I'm gonna be out of town between tomorrow the 13th and the 18th I'm gonna be out of town those days so I won't be able to ship her till the 19th at the earliest because um, that's the day after I get here yeah so just you know keep that in mind um, maybe the 20th because I you know I, I wanna I also want to include a couple um, outfits and a couple of uh, diapers with her you know she's not gonna come just the doll you know she's, she's gonna come with a couple outfits and a couple of diapers and stuff like that and probably a blanket so you know I need to kind of set that up so I'm gonna need you know one more day after I come back from being away uh, yeah guys I'm going away again for a few days but uh, but it's not like a pleasure trip this time it's more to get stuff for the new house um, you know furniture and stuff because you have nothing yet so um, so yeah so I'll be gone for a few days and so I won't be able to to ship it to you if you buy it say like you know tomorrow for example my camera is acting up guys it's stopping every now and then which is annoying me completely I'm gonna have to get a new memory card Let's see if that works better uh, but yeah guys um, if you have any questions please um, send me a DM or leave me a comment or anything and I will get back to you okay remember I also have Instagram you can message me there um, I will leave my email but I hardly ever check my reward email so I don't know if you can contact me like I said by a you know private message or a comment or on Instagram you can DM me there uh, I would appreciate it um, if you want my email well, I will try to I, I will give it to you and I would you know keep an eye on it <laughs> but anyways so yeah so the price is gonna be $80 plus shipping so about 100 105 I would believe uh, yeah and that's all I have to say it's kind of sad to make this video I I wish I had you know a lot of money and I would have to sell any of my babies and be able to get one of my dream babies like right away but I can't I can't and you know you gotta have the room to to have so many babies so sometimes less is more like they say and I decided that maybe downsize downsizing of my collection but having higher quality reborns would be the best thing instead of having you know seven and not be not being able to bond with a few of them you know what I mean I prefer to have less babies and bond with all of them and bond have a strong bond with them than having seven and have like four of them just you know put away you know and never never pay attention to them never make videos or hardly ever you know you know what I mean uh, so yeah ladies uh, thank you so much for watching and baby Brianna hopes to find a new mommy very soon I'm gonna miss her a lot I'm gonna try to take some last pictures before I ship her 
and yeah but well you know that's how this hobby is i mean um just not 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 all of us have the room and the money you know like i said to just go and keep getting babies and not having to sell any of them or have a big nursery i don't have that money or space you know so that's how it is so thank you so so much for watching and like i said if you have any questions please let me know contact me and i will get back to you uh right away remember i'll be gone for a few days then so tomorrow i'm leaving tomorrow so yeah you know but yeah thank you for watching ladies and i see you in my next one bye